Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to create a Squarespace template in 2024. So if you're looking to have maybe a unique design for your site that stands out, creating a custom template is the way to go for you so you can stand up and make a fresh design for your visitors. So make sure to stick by, let's dive right into the video and simply Let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you'll need to go and open a browser. For me here, I'm using Brave. For you, you can use whatever you want. Once you open it, go to the URL section. Just type here squarespace.com and hit the enter button. It's your first time, you'll be taken here to this page. And as you can see in here, you'll be able to click on login to login into your account if you have an account. And if you don't have an account, by any chance, click on create an account to create an account. You can use a Google, Apple, or a Facebook account if you don't want to go through all the boring steps of creating or even logging in into your account. So once you're logged in, you'll find yourself normally in this account dashboard. Here, you'll find all the websites that you have. If you don't have any websites, you can simply just go and click on here on create a website to create your own website. Of course, you can even use the help of AI to create a website. I've already made a video about it and we'll go through it, I guess, later because it's uh, creating a website will, with AI will let you create your own template on Squarespace. So it's one of the ways to do it. Of course, if you have like multiple sites, just go and access the sites that you want. Or as an example, yeah, let's even start with this AI option. Why? Because it's even, I guess, the main option would to create like your own templates, unless you want to start from blank, as an example. And if you're a good designer, you can just go and do it by your own and start, as we said, from scratch. So in here, I'll just go and click on create a website at the top right corner. So once I click on it, I'll be taken here. So from here, they'll tell us to make any template yours with this. So to choose one of the templates that they offer. As we said, for me, we don't want any templates. We want our unique templates. We want to create our own. So as I said before, you can start from blank if you want, or you can use this option, which is build with AI. So click on it. And as you can see, you'll be taken to this new page. As you can see, a template that's unique to you. Design your homepage, add your pages that you need, and choose the colors and fonts. So click on create a site, and let's start creating our unique a square space template. So settings things up. Of course, if you're a beginner, don't worry. I will help you during everything. So you don't have to panic or something like that. It's actually very simple. So starting by filling up the site title. This is the name of your photography site and you can change it later. Of course here, I'll just name my site as example, Omix. Uh, Omix like template, why not? Yeah, other than that, you can choose the brand personality. Of course, each personality has unique sets of colors, fonts, and tones of creating AI-generated content. Having a clear brand personality can help build customer relationship. So, do you want your uh, unique template to be professional, playful as an example, sophisticated, friendly, bold, quirky, innovative, whatever suits you? For my example, I'll just list it as it is innovative. Of course, here you'll be able to see like the text how changing in the background in here and you can even see the text samples of everything so for me as we said i'll choose this innovative and click on next in here as you can see loading ai generated content so nothing basically to do for you all you need to do just chill out and keep choosing stuff so here starting by creating your home page of course what's recommended is those pages like intro digital product section and a footer section for you you can add multiple like other sections, as you can see, a product section, service section, uh, whatever suits you. For me, I'll just let this intro and footer section. Why not? Of course, you can change the layout right now. If you didn't like this one, you can change it to this. You can, if you didn't like this, you can change it to this and etc. Not for this, also for the footer section as example. So click on it, click on change layout and change it however you want. As example, to this or to this, to this, as you can see. So it's up to you. Maybe for me, I'll just choose this. Then click on next. Here, it's time to add the pages that you want. Of course, if you choose like a better title or a better, maybe as example, Omic Store or something like that, you will get multiple other pages recommendations to add. That does not mean 
that you cannot add pages later you'll be able also to do it of course you can also go back to change whatever you want if you want to so here i'll just add uh, this about contacts and course yeah i'll just click as example uh, on also shop maybe no no need i'll just yeah yeah let those three which is about contacts and courses then click on next here it's time to choose the color of your specific template so you can choose from professional example to innovative of course recommended is in uh, in innovative why because you choose innovative late uh, before and of course the, they choose like the fonts for innovative and etc so it's better to choose something for innovative in here maybe an example this is good of course you can change it to anything other than that if you want to but for me i'll just list it as it is here you can change of course and see multiple like colors how this look like and even you can change later if you want to so if you maybe regret your choice or something like that so now just go and choose again the fonts so for me i'll just choose uh, the font of innovative again uh, i'll choose this one yeah why not looks cool then click on finish so what i'll need to do now sit sides relax and wait for the squarespace like ai tool to create my website template as you can see it's created a website using a unique template now for me of course just give it a name you can click on continue and create a course design your site do whatever suits you and yeah here is it your unique templates it's up to you now to go and click on edit to edit more about that template because as you can see they give you with it some sample text some sample images and you would like to change it right of course if you want to change the style of that template you can simply just go here to edit style and you'll be able to change the theme the font the colors the buttons the forms uh, miscellaneous of it everything that you want once you change everything, make sure to click on save at the top right or left corner, then click on exit so your changes will be saved. If you want to add any pages, go here to this left option, click on pages, and you can add like pages to the main navigation or just pages to not linked. And of course, you have multiple options like a blog and you have multiple choices to choose from. You have multiple like things to add a store, portfolio, whatever you want. You can even add some custom fonts, I've already made a, made, made a video about it if you want to go and check it out and a lot of other stuff. So that's going to be it for me today. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next video. So goodbye.